Hi everybody, it's Miss Judy. Welcome to Kids Formation. Let's take a look at our calendar. This was last week. We were on a green dot in the season after Pentecost. Let's click forward to today. You can see that today is still a green dot in the season after Pentecost, but we're getting closer to our next season, the season of Advent. Now it's time for our lesson. We have learned that the church is not a building. The church is the people who love Jesus. We've also learned that the people who love Jesus are the church no matter where they are in the world. So we are the church. We are the church with the people who love Jesus all over the world. Did you notice that I have some clocks with me today? Some different clocks and some watches? Because the church is the people. The church is the people who love Jesus all over the world. And the church is the people who love Jesus from all different times. We are the church with all the people who love Jesus, no matter where they live and no matter when they lived. We are the church with all the people who loved Jesus and followed Jesus. We are the church with them. We are the church with all the people who've already lived and loved Jesus. And we are the church with all the people who will one day live and love Jesus. So we are the church with everyone who has loved Jesus in the past, now in the present, or in the future. Isn't that a wonderful thing that we get to be part of something so wonderful? In the Bible, in the book of Acts, the actions of the apostles, Jesus one more time tells his friends, his followers, go tell everybody about me. And you know what? They did. They learned from Jesus and they taught others and those others taught some more people and those people taught some more people. And so all through all this time, we know about Jesus now because someone told another person who told another person and kept the good news of Jesus moving from the past to the present to the future. Here's a game idea to help us remember what we learned today. From your packet, you'll need the instruction sheet. You'll also need to provide some other items. First, you'll need some envelopes or scrolls to represent people sharing the good news of Jesus. You'll also need to pick three places to represent past, present, and future. You can play this game inside or outside. Start with all your envelopes or scrolls in the place you chose to represent the past. Pick up a scroll, say past, and then move it to the next spot. At the next spot, say present, and then move the scroll to the next spot. At that spot, say future, and put the scroll down. Go back to the beginning and do it again. You can try moving in different ways or using your voice different ways. Whatever ideas you have. However you decide to play, remember, we are the church with the past, present, 
and future. We know about Jesus because in the past, people passed along the good news. And now we are part of passing the good news of Jesus to the future. If you haven't had a chance to watch KF Storytime with Miss Doty, be sure to watch that video. Take care, everybody.